I'll be 2800 here. I'll be 2800 here. Gary, look at that. 2800 bit now. I'll be 2800. Well, Ben, firstly, I like the predictability of the flock and of the breeding program here. It's been in the one family hands for four or five generations now. They're reliable. And the key thing that I like is the, um, is the figures that they provide at each sale. You have a, um, a degree of certainty which you, would, you don't have with that. Uh, and, and also um, just to be able to handle the country and, and the roughness so that we know that the, um, we're going to get the lambs on the ground at the end of the, um, end of the season. Um, Elizabeth, you've come a long way from Gippsland to um by these rams. Uh, tell me what is it that you like about Hazeldean rams? Uh, we've been coming for over 20 years for Hazeldean rams. Um, just really pleased with the way they've brought our micron down over that time and maintained wool cuts, um, our hoggett sheep and our low 16 micron and the older sheep 17 and a half and we're still getting very good wool cuts and they cope with our challenging coastal conditions in Gippsland. been working with Hazeldean for a long period of time. I think it's about 18 years now that I've been working with them. And, um, I guess I really like their philosophy of how they breed their sheep and um, their integrity to the to the product. Um, yeah, and certainly a lot of my clients are getting excellent results from using these bloodlines. Uh, Jim, you've got a really long and healthy association with Hazeldean. Tell us a bit about it. Um, I suppose the reason I continue to come back to Hazeldean you know, year after year to buy stock and particularly particularly sheep. Um, you know, I, I had a long term association of actually working at Hazeldean for nearly 15 years um, and I've really got to understand their whole objective program in both their sheep and their cattle very thoroughly and, it, and it's probably one of the best systems in Australia. Um, and that's why I keep coming back to the repeatability of what I buy uh, in terms of, of the livestock. I know they always perform and we, we run a, over $450 million of agricultural land throughout southern Australia and we still use um, hazelnut genetics widely, particularly in our merino flocks. Okay.